In order to fully conceptualize how ThinkUp ELAR and ThinkUp Writing work together, we need to first consider the strands in our student expectations. Let's look at an example. If students are expected to compose informational text using genre characteristics and writer's craft, they first need to know what the characteristics of informational text are. The student expectation itself doesn't mention specifically what these characteristics are, so how do students know? They learn from studying the structure and characteristics of informational text while they're reading the text. That takes us back to the student expectations connected to reading and understanding multiple genres and diverse written text. So first, students learn to recognize and understand informational text structure through their experiences in reading, and then they fully conceptualize those understandings by implementing or using them in their own writing. This is an example of teaching across the literacy strands and helps to illustrate the philosophy of the 2017 student expectations. When you use the recursive instructional routine, you see how simply changing the learning target will provide multiple opportunities for students to practice and achieve success with composing informational text.